Alright, this is uh, Adam Whitley from uh, Magic at Spadoo, and I'm going to be doing a review today on the Tally Ho Viper step. Um, as you can see, it's a uh, silver box, a Doherty Viper Tally Ho Ultimate Card Handling Playing Card by Illusionist. Um, UV500 Airflow Finish, made in the USA. Uh, my box has US Playing Card Company, Cincinnati, Ohio. Standard normal deck of cards. Uh, back has the back design on it. One of my favorite back designs, I have to say. Um, if you open up the box, uh, or bicycle, standard Tally Ho um, deck of cards. You've got the uh, two regular Tally Ho Jokers, no guarantee on these Jokers, and they're um, identical. You've got your uh, court cards, the King of Spades, and the Queen of Diamonds. All the cards in this deck are silver. There's no color contrast, which I kind of like because it makes it provides for a convincing illusion if you run through the deck. Um, and then, probably my favorite card ever, the Tally Ho Ace of Spades. Uh, you can see the ribbons and the A. Doherty uh, Ace of Spades. Okay, um, so in addition to the review, I'm also going to be doing um, a card trick reveal tutorial type thing. Um, I have my lovely spectator here, Austin. Hey. Um, so Austin, if you will, just say stop, whatever. Stop. Remember this card. Alright. Okay? In the center of the deck. Okay? In the center of the deck. Completely random. Now watch. We'll take the deck, the box, and we'll just give it a little rub. Alright? And you can see the box actually reveals your card. Nice. The Jack of Diamonds. Um, so, okay, so reveal, um, so, okay, so reveal for this trick. It's pretty simple. All you need is a normal Tally Ho Vipers box from Illusionist and a Tally Ho Vipers deck. What you're going to do is you're going to force the Jack of Diamonds. However way you want to force it, you can, uh, Classic force it, which is where you just spread through the cards and you make this one a little more accessible. Or you can riffle force it, keep a pinky break, run down the cards. No matter where they say stop, you just lift up above your break. Or you can do a count force, which is you say pick a number between 1 and 10. Say they say 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then you tell them to count. So any way you want to force a card, force it on them. And basically the trick is done. After all that, it's presentation. You show them the jack, you place it in the center of the deck. No breaks, nothing. The jack of diamonds revealed, put them, in, put them in the box and do what I did. You can rub the box on the deck. You can say you're going to take the essence of your jack and toss it onto the box. Whatever you want to do. as long as you And that's basically all there is to it. Again, I'm Adam Whitley from Skidoo Magic, and me. Hey guys, if you like that, uh, you can visit us at our website, or you can follow us on Twitter if you have any questions at Magic at Skidoo on Twitter, or if you want to, you can email us at Magic at Skidoo at gmail.com. And that's all the time we have for today. Please comment or follow us, talk to us on Twitter. We'd love to hear your comments, and thank you for watching.